Hi, my name is Tracy Cosley. I am a senior lecturer in the Department of Language and Linguistics and I'm currently the head of department also. Because we bring together such different perspectives on language and linguistics, there are all kinds of different courses you can do, whether that's with the modern foreign languages. We have a range of joint degrees as well, so if you were interested in modern languages as well as TEFL, for example, if you wanted to teach English as a foreign language, that's an option. If you were interested in modern languages and linguistics, that's also an option. So within languages, there's a range of things you can do. And within linguistics, there's also similarly a really broad range of things you could do. We have courses that are just in our department, but also links across the university as well. So journalism, for example, journalism and linguistics is a course you can study, or English language and literature is also another sort of joint course that you can study. So we have lots of really exciting kind of interdisciplinary programs. So I think for me, learning languages is important for all kinds of different reasons. I think fundamentally, it's how people do things, um, how people engage with the world, whether that's through speaking, through reading, through writing, languages everywhere. Our students who go on to graduate go on to a wide range of careers. We develop lots of different skills and the skills that are transferable as well. So whether that's critical thinking, whether that's how to process data, whether that's number data, so quantitative data or more qualitative data, so how people say things and what they say. These types of skills are really important, I think, in, in a range of different jobs. But also one of the characteristics of our students as well is that they are really effective communicators. So again, I think that works really well across a range of different careers. So the kinds of things that people might go on to do, they might go on to be teachers, work in things around translation, interpreting, subtitling. We have a range of students that would go on to work in media. We have students that have gone on to work with charities. Um, and again, so that idea of how, if you wanted to run an effective campaign, what kind of language might you need for that? So all kinds of different careers. The Research Excellence Framework is really exciting for us because we did really, really well and we're really, really proud of that. We were first in the country for impact and why that's important is that impact means that what we're doing is important for things. It has an effect on society. It's being taken up in different ways. So one project in particular was looking at language teaching and modern foreign languages in schools. And so this resulted in a, in a paper for government. So that sense of impact, things are changing as a result of what we're doing. We also did really, really well in um, the assessment quality so we were third overall in the UK for that and so that means that the research that we're doing is also considered to be internationally really important and recognised internationally as well. It's really brilliant for us as researchers but for our students we also think that's really exciting too because it means that the students are getting really really good stuff. The lecturers are working with up-to-date information, they're at the top of their game and all of that is transferred into the classroom and they kind of work together so the classroom inspires our research and our research is inspired by our classroom so there's a really nice um, relationship between those things. So yeah, what it means for students is that they can be confident that where you're studying, what you're studying, who you're studying with, and the kind of the nature of the studies are really top class, that you're in one of the best places that you can be if you're interested in language and linguistics.